Doctor Who, The Mind Rubber, Episode 4. Labyrinth Center, Doctor, the Mazusa does not exist. You must believe that. Zoe, I can feel her fingertips like ice. Doctor, no, that's marble. Think of her as a marble statue, a legend. Zoe, but she's real. I've got to look at her. I've got to. Citadel, Jamie reading. One glance from her eyes would turn them to stone. But not all was lost. Suddenly the doctor found a sword at his feet. Picked him up and with one stroke slew the monster. Deborah sent a doctor a sword. Zoe, well, that's it. You're meant to use a sword like Pegasus. Doctor, maybe it's another trap. Doctor, oh, do- Zoe, oh, doctor, please. Doctor, no. Can, how can I kill something that doesn't exist? The doctor drops the sword. Zoe, I've got to open my eyes. I've got to see. Doctor, no, doctor, no, wait. Pegasus, of course. A mirror, a mirror, there. Look at reflection in, in the mirror. Look, can you see her? Zoe, yes. Doctor, this is how Pegasus escaped. He looked at her reflection in his polished shield. In no danger of the reflection. Medusa's snake stopped withering and hissing. Doctor, it's safe now. You can look now. The statue has become a statue again. Citadel, Jamie readings. Cancel, cancel, cancel. The doctor's test report. Failure, failure. Jamie walks away past the window. He came in through the walls. Another doorway. He breaks a light beam and an alarm sounds, making him jump back. A grill comes down across the window. He returns to the story room. Master, attention, attention. There's a stranger inside the building. Call out the search party. Gulliver enters. Gulliver? Ah, the young traveller. I wondered as much. Jimmy, have you been sent to find me? Gulliver, his companions were in a state of uncertainty. Some anxiety concerning his present whereabouts. Jamie, companions, Zoe and the doctor, where are they? Gulliver's safe and well. Jamie, you actually spoke to them? Gulliver, the gentleman desired, I let him know what place I came from and whither I was bound. Jamie, oh, what's that? Mechanical buzzing noise. Gulliver, I heard nothing. Jamie, probably that search party. Gulliver, by the laws of this kingdom, every chamber must be searched. Jamie, if you, if, if they find me. I'm done for. Gulliver, you should be put to death. Jimmy leaves against the wall and the panel slides aside, tumbling him back into recess. Jamie, what about you? Jamie, I shall come Gulliver, I shall not I shall come to no harm. Jamie, if you give me away this if you give me away this time, I'm finished. Jamie goes into the recesses and slides the back panel back the panel back. Gulliver draws his sword and has his flint lock pistol ready. Gulliver, I was ready with the, with, with the hazard of my life to defend this person. Three white robots come down the steps. They pass, walk past Gulliver, who does not see them, and through a panel at the far end of the room, Jamie comes out. Jamie, where are they gone? Jamie, hmm? Gulliver, hmm? Jamie, the white robots. Gulliver, you young sir, I do assure you, there are no such persons here. Jamie, aye, well, well, it's not. I'm getting out of this place. Jamie tries to force the grill at the window. Gulliver, you desire your liberty? Jamie, yes, I mean, I've got to... Well, you got in all right. The thing is, how do I get out? Gulliver, after some, some consideration, Jamie, yes. Gulliver, I was on a pit, I was of the opinion that Jamie, go on, go on, go on. Gulliver, this was altogether impossible. Cliff face, there's a full Disney-style castle near the mountain top. Dot, oh yes, that's the Citadel, right? The question is, how do we get up it there? So it's an awful long way to climb. Doctor, sorry, duck. They hide, and something makes a, a rock behind them go bang. Zoe the Cuckress, a comic book character in black, tights and exaggerated torso and arm muscles. He wears a mask and cape. He's holding a ray gun and speaks in terroric accent. Cataract You are my prisoner, Zoe. It is the Cataract. Doctor, what? Cataract, you will come out and put the hand above the head. Zoe, you know he's fictional too. Cataract, obey or fire the doctor and Zoe raise her hands. Doctor, what with the thing? 
What sort of gun is that? So it's an anti monica monica ray disintegrator. Dot of rubbish. Such a weapon is scientifically impossible. It does not exist. The gun say gun vanishes and Carteris snarls. Dot of well, that seems to take care of that, doesn't it? Carteris, I shall tear you from limb to limb. So old oh, doctor be careful. He could do it, you know. Catris has superhuman strength. Catris, you'll you'll be me, me you'll be me minced meats. Sorry, quickly, Doctor, say you never you know he's a fictional character. Doctor, but I don't know, I never heard of him heard of him. Catris swings at the doctor who ducks. Doctor, oh Zoe run. Catris lifts Zoe out of the way. Doctor, what are you doing? No, please, I'm sure we can talk this over. So he grabs Catris' right hand and then he throws him. Doctor? Zoe? Zoe, lesson 17. Doctor, be careful. Zoe, oh dear. Again, Zoe ducks under Cutter's arm, grabs it and throws him. Zoe, lesson 32. A doctor tries to throw the character too, but fails. Zoe gets Cutter's bottom. He nearly falls on the doctor. Doctor. Don't do anything rash. Zoe repeats. He really throws Cutter until she finally gets him on the ground. A headlock. Cutter's mercy. Zoe, you better submit, you know. Catrice, have mercy. Zoe, your, your neck can take a constant amount. Your neck can only take a certain amount of pressure. Do you submit? Catrice, I submit. Zoe, that's better. Catrice, I'm your slave. Command me. Zoe, do you know the way to the Catrice Citadel? Catrice, they know. Doctor, well, we'll take, well, take us there. There's a good chap. Zoe snaps her fingers. Catrice, I obey. Zoe, we are all following his adventures in the strict sections. In the alley, but to press. Doctor, the strip, old oh, strip cartoon. The year 2000. Zoe, you've been in the year 2000, haven't you? Doctor, yes, but I hardly had time to follow the comic, the strip cartoons. Zoe, well, you better start following this one. He's halfway up the cliff. Come on. Outside the citadel, a sturdy wooden door and a small grill. The small grill in the centre. The doctor is wearing a colorless cape. Doctor, well, thank you, thank you, mister. What did you say his name was? Zoe, C-A-R-C-U-S. Doctor, oh yes, Mr. Cretorus, thank you. Zoe, we won't need be needing you any longer. Run along, Cretorus, I obey. The Cretorus leaves. So, doctor, come along. Zoe, we can't just ring the bell and ask to go in. Doctor, why not? It's the usual way. Zay, oh, Doctor, are you sure this is a good idea? The panel behind the grill slides open, but you only see blackness inside. Master, state your name and that petition. The doctor hides Zoe under the cape. Doctor, I am Zikatras. Master, any that petition? Zoe, what's that? Doctor, shh, year 2000. Comic strip creation, the hourly telepress. Master, authenticated, you may enter. Citadel. Jamie's checking, checking the door. The white rabbit robots went through. Jamie, come on now. You heard them giving orders to take, to look for me. Why do you suppose that, that happened? Master Calabar's conjecture that the, these were orders given by some person in authority. Jamie the master? Calabar, it's possible. Jamie, oh, and, oh, now I'm getting somewhere. Now listen, if you are, they ain't any robots. Who do you think was carrying out those orders? I mean, who was I hiding from? Gulliver, yes. Why, son, the Yahoos. Jamie, who's the Yahoos? Gulliver, cursed race of inferior creatures and never beheld so disagreeable animal. Jamie, well, I haven't seen any Yahoos. You haven't seen any robots. A fine pickle we're in. Zoe, join me. Doctor, what's happened? Jamie, no, no, stay where you are. The doctor and Zoe step... Stop before they break the beam in the doorway, which is about 18 inches off the ground. Jamie, there's an electrical gadget round here somewhere, which sets off a loud gong. I walked for it. The gong went off, and they, sent a, and they set a gang of robots after me. So, Roberts, you mean the same ones that we saw before? Zoe, so, I, the big white ones, I. Do, do, oh, Zoe. So, Zoe, oh, Doctor, did you hear that? Doctor, yes, I thought we... They turned up so they turn up sooner or later. It's a simple photoelectric cell. We just I'd better lift you over it. Jamie, be careful. Doctor, there we are. 
The doctor puts the eye down the other side of the arc and jumps over the beam. Dada, oh my word, Jamie gives... So he gives Jamie his jacket and he puts it on. Zoe, oh Jamie, what happened to you when you left the tunnel? Jamie, I was chased by one of those sol- tin soldiers. Luckily, I jumped my, up the cliff up there. Hey, the thing is, how did we do we get out? Dada, oh, I'm not leaving yet. I'm here on business. Zoe, no, the doctor's made up his mind. He's going to see the master. Magadava, this resolution perhaps may appear very bold and dangerous. Zoe, there you are, you see, doctor. Why do you say that? Magadava, I think you should be, not be here. Master makes rules for the government of his kingdom. It's unwise for you to disobey. Zoe, do you think we shouldn't try and see the master? Magadava, if you like, we'll take what? If you would take my advice, swear a place with the master in his kingdom. Find yourself a place to lodge. Stay quietly. With the expectation that things would mend. Dada, oh, yes, very well. I see, I think. You're very over, very carefully. Go over your servant to Zoe. Your servant, go over leaves. Jamie, you're not going, really going to do what, as he says, are you? Dada, no, of course not. I think. I said I'd think it over. Well, I thought it over. They're staying on and fighting on. Zoe, but we've been fighting on... We've been fighting on in the dark. We don't know where the next attack will come from. Medusa was bad enough. Jamie, oh, Medusa, yes, I read about that. When I was machine here. We words coming out of it all the time. Dada, oh, yes. Do- Jamie, look. Dada, let's have a look. Jamie, there, look. Dada, raids cancel doctor's test report failure. Ah, I think I'm beginning to understand. Jamie, well, I wish I was. Dada, well, the way that somebody writes about an incident after it's happened, it's, it's, it's that's it, tree. Jamie, yes. Dada, but we, when your writing comes first, that's fiction. We have fallen into the master's trap. We had, we would have become fiction. Zoe, oh, it's horrible. Come on, let's get out of here. Dada, Zoe, where are you going? Zoe, Do- Zoe, before it's too late. Doctor, don't go. So he's all right. Doctor, no, no, not through there. So he walks through the archway and the alarm sounds. Jamie, oh no. Our master, our intention. There are still strangers at large. So we knew the search. The strangers must be found. So what are we going to do? Jamie, I mean, that's funny. Gulliver, walk through there. Doctor, Gulliver's not real. We are. So they're coming. Where did, where do we, can we hide? Dada, we no need to hide. Say, so, why not? If they find us, Doctor, let us find us. Jamie, you mean you just stand here and wait? Doctor, yes, why not? We'll ask for an interview the master. Zay, they may not give us time to ask for anything. Zoe, they may not, make, they may not give us time to ask for anything. Jamie, look, three white robots have entered. Dada, are you looking for us by any chance? You might want an interview with the master. The door, Jamie was examining, early opens, master. How very fortunate. Do come in, doctor. I've been expecting you. Oh, don't be alarmed. Won't you walk into my parlour? Dada said the spider to the fly. Come along, control room. Jamie, it's hard to see anything. Dada, where are you? Master, here, patiently waiting. A store to hitch next angle glass panel opens and Zoe, Jamie and the doctor enter. A white robot stands guard. The master seats in his console. And now we see his face. We also see a large glass globe with filaments surrounding around him. A master is the elderly bearded gentleman, a velvet jacket and skull cap, wearing half moon reading glasses. A skull cap has wires connecting it to the globe. Master Oh Doctor, this is a great pleasure. You and your two companion, young companions. Now let me see. Oh, yes, yes. Zoe and Jamie. I have her dossiers here in front of me. Zoe, you appear to be well, very well organized. Master, oh, yes, indeed. We have to be. Running in this place requires a moment's attention to detail. Responsible position, but very rewarding. Doctor, responsible, huh? To anyone, someone else? Master, not to someone, another power higher than you begin to imagine. Oh, I must congratulate you on your great skill, which you tackled the various stages of your examination. Dada, what is the purpose of all these tests? Master, well, do you know, when I was first brought here myself, I was bewildered as you are. 
Mark Jamie. Well, how long have you been here? Last I left England in the summer of 1926. It was a very hot day, I remember. I think I must have dozed off at my desk where I woke. But, but, but that's a long story. Did you ever hear of the adventures of Captain Jake, Jack Harkaway? Written by Frank Richards, the son of Cinnamon for Charles Harold St. John Hamilton. Don't know, I can't say that. Wait a minute, a seal in Boy's Magazine. Master the Ensign. Dr. Ensign. Master for 25 years delivered 5,000 words every week. Dr. Ewan Writer. Zoe. 25 years, 5,000 words a week. Well, as well, over half a million words. Dr. Master, yes. Probably some kind of record. Anyway, that's why I was selected to work here. Jamie, are you all the one in, that's in charge of all this? Master, in one sense, yes, Doctor. Oh, all this. Ah, is this, all this in charge of you? Master, my brain is the source of the creative power which keeps this operation going. Doctor, I see, that means you are virtually a prisoner. Master, oh no, 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 glow grows. Master, you, you, you are must, excuse me for a moment. Master writes in a large book. We see resistance is useless and then to deny the top of the page and submit you, you will for the Jamie. Come on, doctor, let's get out of here. Zay, yes, let's get, gives, it gives me the creeps. Don't know, I need to find out more. Jamie, well, look, you keep him talking. And so you will find another way out. Dada Jamie, I think you would be safer if we stick together. The girl stops glowing and the master stops writing. Master, oh, I'm so sorry you kept, I, to have kept you waiting. Now, where were we? Doctor, you are about to answer my question. Are you a prisoner here? Doctor, well, no. No, I shouldn't say that. In fact, I rather like being here. I eventually, I have everything I could possibly want. Jamie and Zoe sink around the back of the globe. Master this vast library of all the known works of fiction, all the masterpieces written by Earthmen since the beginning of time. Library Jamie and Zoe enter a room full of hot bookcases. Zoe, I don't think you notice. Jamie, no, let's try it down there. Control room. Doctor, I see, yes. An only Earthman's type creature, a power to create fiction, a power to imagine. Master, exactly. This is the one field which intelligence. I serve, cannot complete. A man, a man of boundless imagination, a powerhouse, a life, lifeline, as you might say, doctor. This is the, what is this intelligence you serve? And why was I brought here? Master, well, as you see, I'm no longer young. Where you are, doctor, are ageless. You exist outside the barriers of time and space. Doctor, and you want, and you want me to, master, to take this, uh, to go over. Unique situation to take my to take my place, Doctor. I refuse. A globe grows and takes over the master. Master, refusal is impossible. You are here to serve us. There is no alternative. Library. So we've got to find a way out of here. Z- Jamie, there must be a door somewhere. Look, we're going to get the doctor away. So Jamie, to white robot. Another one from behind. I try to run and the third blocks them. Jamie, no. Back this way. Control room. Master, resistance is useless. Submit your will for the sake of the greater good. It had been decided, Doctor, I refuse. I shall make that decision for myself. Globe stops and Master returns to normal. Master, you will find there is only one decision over to you. Mission accomplished. Procedure is arranged. Dada, what does that mean? Master, latest chapter of the serial story. I read you the last sentence. So I mean, I'll read you the last sentence. Zoe and Jamie attempt to escape. They're making it, f- but they're making it through to the library. They're pushed by a party of guards and were overpowered. Dada, oh no, Zoe, Jamie. Jamie, Zoe. Master, you're prepared to cover right now in your, your life in turn for layers. Is that a bargain? Look, library, the white robots are using the chests. Units on Zoe and Jamie. Zoe, oh, Jimmy, my eyes. Jimmy, I can't see. What? Are, where are you? Quick, back, back away, Zoe. Here, quick. Jamie leaves Zoe between the pages of an open book. Chapter headings on Rwanda. It's so peace. 
Ed read in French. Jenny, no, it's the book. Back out again. The robots closed the book. Zoe, push. Jamie, push. Open it. It's closing. No. 